No, I don't think he can. It's too bad. All right, I think they're both gonna five foot step and then cast reduce person on Trist Christmas. Oh. So I need two will saves from you. Two? I thought you said you couldn't stack it. Yeah, but they're just gonna keep doing it until you fail. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Which isn't today, but not this day. Yeah, Trist Christmas <laughs> is sitting there. All right. So this is basically what it looks like. Trist Christmas is sitting there. He gets. A, a pink ball that goes, woo, boonk, and it bounces off him. Then another two come out from, like, little tiny babies and hit him in the knee. And he's like, what the fuck is happening right now? <laughs> he has no idea. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, boy. His willpower isn't exceptionally high either, so it's like... <laughs> oh, All right. God. She five foot steps and busts open the door to the south, provoking an AOO from Buckley. Is that what does that mean? Just one attack? One attack. So it's gonna be his bite. Yeah, she's looking really bad. It looks like she's getting ready to run. The bite doesn't hit. Holy shit! Well, now she's gonna run inside. Does Buckley have combat reflexes? Does now, I believe. Okay. Ooh. Then you get an AOO again as she runs away. Okay. <coughs> yeah, that one fucking. Hey. Uh, bite again. Yep, you you definitely kill her. Uh, tell, <laughs> tell me how that happens. <laughs> so she's like, kicks open the door, she looks back, and Bucky just goes, ow. <laughs> Bites her face right off. And spits it out. <laughs> Unfortunately, it appears that you have triggered the next encounter. I didn't trigger shit. Remember, we're still hasted, so what's up? Bring it on, motherfucker. Okay, Nelfina. <laughs> you finally arrive. your turn, you arrive. And I show up. And I look around. <gasps> you guys you started Buckley. the party without us. You see Buckley literally bite someone's <laughs> face off, like, before oh, you walk, like, as you appear. Buckley, here. that is so sweet of you. Hello, not so, comparatively not so little one anymore. Hello. Wait a minute, what? Oh, because you're tinier than me. Look at how cute you are. I like pick him up. And I, like, you're the same pick size. Her up and I just, like, not swing that around. That you're the same size. Does she weigh less than me? No. You probably weigh about the same. Okay, I struggle to pick her up. <laughs> you're still too heavy. You're so fat. <laughs> <laughs> what would you like to do for your turn besides pick that de jure up? Walk around the table. Okay. Yeah. Not under it like an idiot. Ugh. Well, I don't need you now. All right, no, yeah. There's two dudes there. Just walk around the side there. Anything else? Um, no. <laughs> All right. Diego. Well, I'll make a little prayer to Rastil and uh, pick up the key and stand on the platform. Yep, you're completely covered in ice, and then you die instantly. <laughs> yep. <It> was, uh, <laughs> you've activated my trap card. The fifth person, the sixth person to go through always dies. That's the, that's the trick to it. I, I'm just the fifth, so I'm a good. Yeah, well, nice. No, oh, yeah. I guess just you are. Our next person's going to die. That's what, hard. What knowledge check would help me on little tiny things? Uh, nature, right? For Fey? They are Fey. Dang. Yep. Yeah, you know that these are Atomies. They're. Tiny green skinned humanoids that wield needles as rapiers. Are they cold touched, Faye? Uh, these ones are. N yes, they are. Okay, then. Now you know the reason why they chained me up. Burning hands. Oh, yeah. Is Buckley still injured? Uh, one point of damage. Okay, Buckley heals one, I take one. <laughs> okay. No, that doesn't. Lifelink only works if you have five or more points of damage. Oh, if you take damage that turn, okay. No, it only activates if you have five points okay. of damage to take. Okay, then never mind. That doesn't happen. Yep. I still need the reflex saves from the both atomies as okay. fire lances out from my scorched arms. You should go to a doctor. They both that. fucking wreck you. Well, they still take half of 4d4, so... 4d4? They laugh at your tiny pathetic damage. You take five points. Which happens to be the whole health, and they die. No, they're good. They are good for now. Okay, Triss, you hear someone 
drunkenly stumbling coming from the next room over the side of the fight. Like, you, you still hear the shrieks of Mural dying, and you hear someone standing up and sliding a sword out of a sheath and going, Who the fuck is disturbing my sleep? What the fucking bloody hell? Oh, shit. It's what? a drunk man! Woo. It's a drunk it's a, woman. It's a woman's voice, actually. Oh, okay. A drunk woman, and I wish we had not disturbed her. Why? What's going on? Things are about to get bad. Who is it? I think I will let the GM reveal that information. Oh. What do you want to do, Tris? Uh, I don't know. Shoot one of the the little gooby gabs. Okay. Uh, actually. I have a, a spell I should be able to use, yeah? Oh. Uh, so how much do these things weigh, these little dudes? <laughs> <laughs> They're tiny. They're tiny. They probably Would you weigh. say that I could pick them up with Mage Hand and throw them out a window? No, because Mage Hand can't work on magical things. Oh, it can't okay. work on living things. It only works on unattended objects. Mm, okay, then uh, let's do an acid splash on on the scene that they're on. Okay. Uh, I don't know what to roll for that. <laughs> I'm sorry. You need to roll um, your dexterity plus your attack bonus. Oh, shit, yeah. Dexterity <laughs> plus attack bonus. And you're attacking their touch AC. Uh, attack bonus is... Three and my dex is three, so I'm rolling at a six. Oh. Yep. Which one do you want to attack? Oh, they're both in the same area, right? So yeah. can't the acid splash affect both of them? It's not a literal splash. It's like a tiny ball. What the? <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter in any one of them. Okay. Roll your damage. Uh. The D3. One D3. But that's pathetic. You said it, not me. Yeah. You hit this thing dead on and it's like, ah, my face! What does it, what does it do, though? It must do something other than just, like, nope. a green boop. Oh. No. It is a, it's a cantrip. It's just a green boop. Zero level spell that you can use infinitely. I would have done more damage stepping on them. I say as I put this spell back into my book, never to be used again. <laughs> yeah, so Buckley's turn. And that's when you fight a troll. <laughs> yeah, you're going to be yep. glad you have it when you fight a troll. What do you want to do with Buckley? Uh, he's going to go, hello, who is that around the corner? Uh, so the woman inside there is like, I, the name is Hestrig. What are you doing in my fucking room, you tiny lion-shaped griffin creature? <laughs> oh, that is easily explained. You see, we were killing a ephemeral lady who happened to kick open the door. I will gladly close the door for you if you'd like. Oh, yes, please. I'm going to need a little while to wake up. Uh, you mind if I have breakfast first? Oh, please. I mean, uh, I would love to talk to you after this as well. Oh, yes, we'll okay. talk. We'll talk. He, like, shuts the door with his mouth. Okay. <laughs> 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 All right. And then he will pounce on this dude. Uh, so if you're shutting the door, that's a move action. Oh, well. So you won't okay. be able to pounce anymore. You'll basically just be able to move up to them. Okay. Fuck it. Right. Yeah, he shuts the door, moves up to them, and gobbles one up with a bite <sighs> attack. Wait, how many attacks can I do? Just one? You can't can't make any attacks because you have a move action and a move action. So oh, move well. to close the door and then to move up to them. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, I'll just wait here then at the door after I close it. I wouldn't okay. go too deep like that. All right, uh, Nefrina, you have two daggers in hand, or is it one dagger in hand? I have. One dagger. Okay. This little creature here pops up and tries to touch one of your daggers. Oh, it's shiny. Yeah, there's like a green streak of like wisp coming off of its hand as it approaches you. Can I smack it? 
<laughs> no. Uh, not yet. Stop it. Let's see here. It's a plus one, plus three. That's not going to hit. The other one does the exact same thing. So they're both running side by side. With these, is a sixteen going to hit your touch AC? Uh, that's a good question. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Trish should have got another attack. No, he cast a spell. Is that touch no, AC an is eleven? An attack. A spell is an attack. You have to take. When you do a full attack action, it's literally a physical attack, like a. Oh, a okay. Aura. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. Continue. Um, so one of the ones goes low and misses, but it forces your dagger to go high. The other one uh, touches your your dagger. Can you make a will save on behalf of your object? Oh, wait. As what? you feel your object like start vibrating. What is it? Flat D twenty. I don't actually know the will saves for objects. No, it's uh, twenty two. Fucking hell! Yeah, they, your dagger's like slowly getting smaller, and then it steps back to perfect size, and both of the tiny creatures are like, "No, no, 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 no!" Yeah. Hold up now. Okay, from the room, Buckley, you hear a, a noise that sounds like thump from the room to the south of you. Okay. Uh, from the south? You mean, like, the room that I just closed? The Buckley's yep. closed? Yep, you just heard a flumping noise. Oh, I know what Buckley's <laughs> like gonna do next turn. Someone knocking over a chair. Okay, yeah, but I know what Buckley's gonna do next turn. Well, hey, Fina. Are you okay? <laughs> I heard a noise from in the room. <laughs> the one that actually, like, touched my dagger, the one that's on my side, Yep. I'm turning on that mofo. Alright, let's do it. So what do I got? Bitch better have my money. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that song is just so weird. Yeah, I know. It's like one of her weirdest songs ever. It doesn't <laughs> fit with who she is, you know? Wait, but it's not that, so... Alright. 23! Yeah, that'll hit. Alright, that's gonna suck for damage, though. 1d2. 1d3. Hey, it's like you got an acid splash. But a knife. Yeah, yeah. One damage. That's enough to kill it. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you amplify the damage because you're hitting a smaller thing or nope. something? Really? Oh. Hmm. Okay. Yep. Too used to Graham's rules, I guess. Yep. That's the thing, like, I have to, like, not... I can't play that. Alright, you deal no damage. Yep. You hit this thing with skin and your dagger bounces off of it. It seems to be made of some sort of supernaturally resistant material. I should have like just kicked magic. it. They have DR cold iron, don't they? You, Viega, you, you appear behind everyone else. Hey guys, what's going on? Ugh, there's so many dead people in here. A little crowded right here right now. Yep. Yep. What do you want to do? Moving over here. Okay. Run along the table. Should I, sure I don't have a shoot? Jump the table! Uh, you should still have enough movement to shoot. Okay. Yeah. Let's hit the one in front. Okay. That one right there. Alright. Cock an arrow and uh, hit the wall. You hit the mirror behind it, which instantly shatters. Giving you five years of bad luck. <laughs> Does it cause any damage to any of the people in front of the mirror? No. No. Good. Desiree. Uh, question before I begin. Can I five foot step to there? Yep. Okay, cool. I'm going to cast Protection from Evil on Nafina. Okay. And say, you do not bring cold iron daggers to this place. I will kick uh, it from now on. Oh, well, at least I give you now a flanking partner. Well, thank you. And you have a plus two deflection bonus to AC against all evil creatures. Are you God, I'm thinking back to your uh, your cat folk guy. Yeah. Yeah. This Just is the wind. exact same situation, yes. What flanking melee partner. weapon do you have? I have a cold iron spiked gauntlet. Don't bring Kyle cold iron in here. <laughs> Triss. Hello! Hey, how you doing? Uh, mm, let's shoot some little doobers. Yep. With my shooting McMahon. Yep. Woo! 
<laughs> but before that happens, Buckley is going to open the door with his mouth again, and he'll say, Ah, oh, my lady, I happen to hear a noise. Are you quite all right in here? So you see the woman standing inside again. She's mm. got her sword out, and it's driven mm. into the ice before her, and it looks like she's doing one of the Dragon Ball Z power-up stances. There's, like, waves of snow and ice rising around her, so. reversing gravity, and she's just like, <laughs> Oh, you have done it now. What did you do? Uh, do you need help in any way? Just close the door! I gotta have breakfast! This is breakfast. Quite strange ritual you have. I wish to do a uh, thingy so I can see what it is. A thingy. A spellcraft check? Does Buckley have spellcraft? Uh, I believe he does not. But <laughs> I believe that Triss <laughs> also does not. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> yeah, you're both consulting with each other. You're like, I don't know what the fuck this is. What do you know? And Triss is like, Shit, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Close the door. She's obviously eating breakfast. Okay. If Buckley, like, closes the... I will be right here, my So lady. you open and the like... door and close the door. That's your whole turn. <laughs> yeah. and, I yell to, and I yell to Buckley, Hey, I'm good flanking partner in Pinch, but I am not permanent solution. Get the get flying butt over here. He, like, uh, as he's closing the door with his mouth, he's like, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. And that's his turn. Um, uh, Trist Christmas, on the other hand, will shoot the little dooba doobs. Okay, let's do it. Um, Trist motherfucking Christmas shoots all the guns. Pew pew. Trist motherfucking Christmas doesn't hit for shit. Nope, Oops. not even close. What about that one? Uh, are you shooting a bow? Yeah. Okay. Uh, do you have precise strike? What's Why would it need precise strike? Okay, so they're in melee combat with mm. somebody. So if you don't have a feat that negates that, you take a minus four to your attacks. Uh -uh. Sure. Negative four to attacks. Okay. Oh, that boom, one boom. misses as well. Okay. All right. Motherfucking Christmas puts away his crossbow. <laughs> is it a, is it actually a crossbow? Yes. Okay, you can only make one attack around with a crossbow. He's hasted. I will, I will use the. Yeah, oh, he's we're right. He's hasted. That's okay. Uh, Desiree, you get two arrows <laughs> if you have combat reflexes. As both of them five foot step into your square. I do not, but seventeen hit. Yes. Or, actually, it's a plus two, but whatever, it hits. So it's a... Oh, it's a D3 plus nothing. One cold iron damage. Okay. Boom! And now they're going to start stabbing you with their flanking. Ah with their flanking. We flank the shit out of you. <sighs> Whoa! Damn, damn. What? Uh, what's your AC there, Digger? Man makes a new character in a fucking episode. <laughs> alright, alright, calm down. The 19 will not hit. <clears throat> okay. Yes. You take Pretty one nice. hit for one non lethal damage and two <laughs> lethal damage. It like stabs you in the eye and you manage to get your eye closed, but it hurts like hell and you're like, ah! Tell me about, tell me about their daggers. Uh, they're rapiers. Okay. So here's what I imagine happens. You know when you're wearing sunglasses sometimes, and then a big I gust take one wind. damage. Okay. Big gust of wind comes past, but then he, it still gets something in your eye, and you're like, "Fucking shit!" I don't shit. take any non-lethal damage, and I don't take any non-lethal damage because that stuff. He. Even the crit Ooh. didn't do anything. Yeah, even the crit didn't do it. Oh, oh shit. She got big. She got big. She's like. Okay, you can open the door now. Very well, my lady. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think she's going to do it herself, right? She grows a big size, she opens the door, and then she's going to blast Buckley with a spell. Oh. Yep. Wait, can she, can she move and move and then open a door? She doesn't no. need to move. She, but got she had to open the door. Uh, opening doors and move, move. 
Right. Yes. So all she has ten foot reach, so she doesn't have to move anywhere. Okay, but she just moves the and then she casts a spell. That's it. Okay. All right. Yep. And what's she casting? Uh, well, large broccoli. Do you have, have, spell have, spell a, have Yeah, a you can't tell. <laughs> they want to have a power range to fight, so that's what she's doing. <laughs> uh, well, we've already established that's going to hit Buckley's touch AC, right? Fucking what is with this touch AC bullshit? You're like, hey, summoner. What's your uh, touch AC? And I'm like, 12. And you're like, sweet. Let's make everything do touch uh, AC. Damage. So here's, here's what happens to Buckley. Like, he opens the door, and she brings her sword forward, and you see that there's a glowing ball of ice there, and it zooms and hits Buckley in the face. He has oh. cold damage resistance. So. This isn't a snowball fight. Then... Is it cold damage? Like, what's going on there? It will be cold damage, yes. Okay. So he has <laughs> five, I believe. Did you take the yeah? It's a like cold resistance CR five. Yeah. So this does three d six plus three. Oh. And you need to make a fort save. Oh. Oh, she cast snowball, didn't she? Yep. Okay, you're gonna take nine points of cold damage. That's okay. after your your dr. <laughs> what is Buckley's for? This is Buckley. What the hell? The cow? That was. That was the cow says. <laughs> well, okay, Buckley's the shot to his face stuns shot him moment. No. And you're too late. <laughs> nope. This is Buckley being late, paralyzed. <laughs> Buckley is staggered and can only take a move or a standard action, which still means no full attack and no pounce for him. Milady, what are you doing? <laughs> you idiot. She says, you I am the lion. fucking guard captain. I think I told you that. Either way, I am going to eliminate you. And you Oops. will be my breakfast. <laughs> Oops. Wait. Make sure you mark down your nine. Wait, 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 wait. Why was Buckley Why? being so nice? Did did Buckley? Get, oh yeah, he opened the door again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. That's right, cool. So mark down the nine. Yep. Shot to the heart. Nafina, you're up. Uh, little guys are on. Okay. Wait. I'm so... still giving you flanking bonus. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, they are facing away from me, right? Well, this is Pathfinder. They're facing every direction. But oh. yes, you will. But you can flanking. five foot step up, and then if you stab them, you will get your sneak attack. Yeah, you yep. can step up, senpai. Yeah. That's what I'm doing. All right, let's do it. Stabby, stab, stab. Roll them dice. Oh, why do I forget what I'm doing? You know, I might do this. Shorten it a little bit. I'm using my. Just my decks on that, right? Stab, stab. Your attack bonus as well. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And you get a plus two because you're. Whoa. You're flanking. Nine, eleven. Oh. Okay. Twenty-two. Yes. That stab him. Stabby, stab. Roll damage plus sneak attack, which is. Awesome for Can you, you do enough damage to penetrate their DR? Probably. Maybe. So I have Sneak Stab, which is 1d8, 1d4. You have 2d8 now. 2d8. Plus 1d4. 1 1 4. 4. Yep. And then Sneak Attack, which is 1d6, or 2d6. No, no, no. You're, you're, your, sneak stab. your Sneak Stab is your Sneak Attack. Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright, I see how that works then. Right, you're a Knife Master, so you have improved Sneak Attack. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you definitely do enough to kill this tiny creature. <laughs> well, do oh. I need to roll the other one then? Uh, the D four. Nope, no. Okay, it's definitely dead. I. That's for touching my. Finally, no, I... you killed one of those things. All right, Eviega. Quick rule question, real quick. What's yep. your clarification on range with sneak attack? Are they flanking right now to give advantage of that or no? Uh, for range sneak attack, you have to be stealth. Stealth okay. within 30 you can't, feet. You can't shoot into somebody who's flanking. That's not nope. how it works. No problem. That's what I thought. Yeah. So let me try stealth then. Behind the table, if I yep. can. Let's do it. 
Woo! <gasps> nice. You son of a bitch. It can't. It can't <laughs> contest that. It only has a plus seven. So, yeah, you're essentially invisible. Yeah. Go ahead and take the shot. Take the fucking shot. <gasps> really? Oh. Uh, a twenty to hit for twenty one. to hit. Yeah. You but there's a neg there's four. a negative four because I'm got cover. Oh yeah, then that's gonna miss. Ooh. Oh, but you're attack you're attacking flat foot, right? Yeah. Which will hit. Okay. Yay! Dealing five oh, minus a DR. So three points of damage. Bring it to eight damages. Which is still not enough to kill it. It's still damage. Indeed it is. Desiree. Buckley, you heal five. Cool. I take five. Ba -da 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 -da. How's everybody else looking? You can see the green lines. Eviega, how far are you down? I'm fine. Four. Oh, you're only down four? Yep. Damn. Okay. Then I'll five foot step back and uh, I'm out of his threatened range now, right? Yes. I'm going to cast Cure Light on myself. Okay. Tris Christmas. Tris motherfucking Christmas gets the AOK to enlarge person. We're going to have a Power Ranger fight. All right. Next turn, your enlarged person will go off. Really? Even if I spend the whole turn doing it? Yeah. Yep. It takes a full okay. round. That's why she spent the round standing there powering up. Oh, she was eating breakfast, Arthur. Of course she was. No, she's about to eat breakfast. <laughs> what do you want Buckley to do? He can either make a single attack or move. Or pouncing? Nope. Oh, yeah, actually, you can make... Oh, okay, you could make a pounce, but the only <laughs> legal target you can make a pounce on is the tiny creature. Really? How far away do you have to be to make Ten a pounce? Ten feet. Can he take a five-foot step and then pounce? No. No. You can't be uh, like, all right, hold on a second, I'm going to shift gracefully and then leap towards you. You know, you, you get a you get a, you get get a a crazy leap going on. No. Uh, okay, uh... Buckley will go here. In the middle of the two. Oh, shit. Singing the bobs. Get your lion-y butt over here. <laughs> there is quite a large woman who has just feeding e fi finished eating her fast after break. Yeah, she I already... broken her fast. I already chastised you for it. Chastised? <laughs> I don't feel any pain. Aside from the big blue orb that hit me in the face. Yes, you're welcome for me healing part of that. <coughs> Can someone say something real quick? What's that? Okay, say something again. What's that? Excellent. All right, I don't know why my headset keeps cutting out on the right-hand side. But it's time to go back to Best Buy. Whoop, whoop. All right, so sorry, what was Buckley doing? He's just moving? Yeah, he just moved. All right. Before you do that, I feel that I should inform you that she can currently reach Buckley and attack him with her sword if he moves. Gross! Uh, if you guys five foot and over there? If you five foot, that's all you can do. Really? What? Oh, because he's yeah. stunned? No, if you five foot, that's the only movement you can take for a round. Interesting. Not even if I double move? No. You can't double five foot step. If you five foot, that's your whole movement for the round. You can't you can be attacked only... during the process, but you basically sacrifice everything else to do that. Yeah, five foot step is a free action, but you can't move. All right, well, I'm just. Other gonna... than that, you're, be. you're just gonna five foot step. Yeah. All right. I mean, Eviega will be able to help with the fatty McBumba when she rolls around the corner here. So. All right. <laughs> Desiree, uh, you get an AOO. As this creature begins casting a spell, it is not casting it defensively. Wait, could Buckley close the door? Yeah, you could five foot step and then close the door. So, so basically what happens is he gets hit in the face with a blue orb and he's like, my lady, and he like closes the door. Or, no, that's, <laughs> like, back. That's, that's a 13, not a 14, sorry. That's going to miss. Okay. All right, it turns invisible. Uh, oh, no. All right. This you fucking door yeah, you can. He's opens once again as she <laughs> steps to here and then power attacks on Buckley. Wait, even around the corner? Yeah, even around the she corner. She has 10 foot reach, so she's huge. Wait, don't I get like some sort of cover? Oh, wait, no, if I close the door, I can move fully, right? No. 
Well, she wouldn't be able to hit through the door then, right? Okay. If you close the door, that's your move action. You're staggered. You're staggered, so you can only take one action. Oh, and then I five foot step. <laughs> okay. Uh, 